Hi everyone, I would also like to welcome you to our webinar. Today we would like to introduce to you Field Extender, which allows adding additional fields to any Sage 300 ERP screen. You can add various types of additional fields, such as string and number. However, I would like to draw your attention on two types, rich text which allows you to enter unlimited and formatted text and electronic attachments which allows attaching soft copy of any document to Sage 300 ERP transactions or master date. Let me show you this on an example. As you can see, on my Sage 300 ERP desktop, I have FE item screen. This is a customized Sage 300 ERP IC item screen. The customization is done using Visual Basic 6, which is also used to develop Sage 300 ERP screens. A sample code for such customizations can be downloaded from our website. This screen is identical to IC item screen. Uh, the only difference is the attachments button. Clicking this button, I can enter additional information for my item. All the information you can see on this pop-up is implementation specific. Now I have an option here with my sample company to add an image to the item. To do this, I will just go and say attach. Find the image I want to attach and click save. When I'm attaching an image, the image itself is saved on the database. If you prefer, instead of attaching the image itself, just keeping the hyperlink, we, you can use the hyperlink feature of Field Extender. Here you will just enter the link of the file and you can save it. When this is done, just by clicking on the link, you can open the image again. In this case, only the link will be saved in the database. Now let's see another example of field extender customization, sale order. Again, you can see an FE order screen, which is a customization of a Sage 300 ERP OE order entry screen. And the only difference between this screen and the standard screen is the attachments button. Order entry customization allows you to define fields for both header level and detail level. Today I will show you how you can enter, for example, a warranty agreement for an item on a detail level. To do this, again, I will click the attachments button, go to the detail level. I can see various fields defined for the detail, among which we warranty agreement. What I can do here, I will just copy paste my warranty agreement text from a template add it to the rich text and change it as required save this I also have a text field here which is 255 characters and I can enter an extended comment here. Uh, however, as you can see, I cannot format this text and the size is limited. I would also like to mention here that images and rich text can be added to the report. However, this report cannot be printed from inside Sage 300 ERP. Uh, so far, I have showed you examples of entering FE information from the customized screen. However, the same information can be entered and viewed from optional entry field screen. Let's do this for the banks. I don't have banks set up in, for field extender yet, so I'll do the setup. For this, I'll enter first banks as a transaction. Let's find it. I'll define the required tables for FE. Save this. I'm planning to enter two type of fields for the banks. One will be a text, which will be the sweep number, and the next one will be an attachment.
I will define this field. Let's find the banks here and define text. Uh, my text letter will be 255 characters and the next one will be attachment. I'll choose here the type of the field. And I don't have to define the size for attachment, it is coming automatically. I'll save this and create the FE table. Next, I will make sure that I have field set created. My banks will be using only one, so the default field set will be sufficient. And the last step here for setting up banks will be defining the fields, how they should appear on the screen for each field set. Uh, I have only two fields, let's add it. I'll add the attachment type and call it agreement. And I'll add the text type and call it swift. I'll just save this. Now I will come to the screen I was talking about. This screen you can use without having any customization. So I will select here banks. I will select the bank I'm looking for and add attach the agreement. Here is my agreement. And I will enter the Swift number. Okay, saving this will save this extender for optional field with my bank. Here I can also view the attachment with IC for IC items or OE order entry details, etc. Uh, field extender is available in two editions, Pro and Light. The Pro edition has the full functionality of field extender and allows customizing almost any SH300 ERP and third party screens which use OCX. Uh, while the Light Edition serves as a platform for the new Citronix product, Document Attachment Applet, and is distributed at no cost. Document Attachment Applet are in fact packaged customized screens with field extender functionality. The list of available applets can be found in our website. This is all we had planned to show you today for field extender. Thank you.